Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about how to use the order of operations in order to evaluate expressions. Math problems must be done in the correct order. You can use the term PEMDAS in order to help you complete the correct order of operations. The P stands for parentheses, E for exponents, M for multiplication, D for division, A addition, S subtraction. So let's look at example and see if they follow the correct order of operations. Okay, let's get started with 7 plus 4 times 5. Which answer is correct, 55 or 38? If you go straight from left to right, you go 7 plus 4 equals 11 times 5 equals 55. The correct answer is 27. If you follow the correct order of operations, you will complete multiplication first. 4 times 5 is 20. Then you will complete addition, so the correct answer is 27. Let's look at 4 plus 12 divided by 4. Is the correct answer 3 or 7? Going left to right, 4 plus 12 is 16. 16 divided by 4 equals 3. However, the correct answer is 7. If you follow the correct order, you complete division first. 12 divided by 4 equals 3. Then addition, which is 3 plus 4, equals 7. Finally, let's look at an expression with an exponent. Which answer is correct, 24 or negative 4? Going left to right, 5 plus 9 equals 14 because 3 squared is 9, minus 6 equals 8, times 3 equals 24. The correct answer is negative 4. If you follow the correct order of operation, you will work the exponent first, 3 squared is 9, then multiplication, 6 times 3 equals 18. Next, you go to addition. 5 plus 9 is 14. And then finally, subtraction. 14 minus 18 is negative 4. So that's how you use the orders of operation to evaluate expressions. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.